Hello and welcome to the video for this listing of a Pentax DSLR K50. So we'll just go through what's uh, with it. There is the owner's encyclopedia, no doubt in many different languages. The original charging caddy and a UK mains plug for it. Uh, LED on there for charging status. There is also a USB lead for downloading what's on the SD card onto your PC and the camera itself well it's in bright red and it's uh, very well made actually it's got a bit more weight and substance to it than your average camera but that's because it's got significant improvements in weatherproofing so uh, it has a water resistance uh, front lens which is in very good order the whole camera's just got a shutter count of over just over a hundred so it's hardly been used um, it takes a remarkably nice picture as well actually, I was very surprised to see what the picture quality was like. Uh, viewfinder, uh, we've got live view as well, I'll just take a shot with it. Uh, I'll just bring in our model a moment, uh, so we'll zoom out, Ooh, it just increased the shutter count by 5%. <laughs> Uh, forgot that. Yeah, um, so it zooms and autofocus is all good and the aperture on the lens is working fine. You can probably hear the autofocus working there. Little noisy, but uh, hey ho, that's the way they are. Uh, it shoots raw as well and uh, has autofocus, manual focus, buttons, built-in flash, I may have said that. Uh, there's the blurb on the lens, 3.5 at its widest. Uh, and as you can expect, the whole camera body is really nice. The only negative is the screen has got some pixels gone. So we're looking at that black stripe just down there, if I can show you that. Can you see that there? Yeah. But, uh, so it's not the end of the world. It's only about 3% of the whole screen, I would say. You do have a viewfinder anyway, and all in all, uh, a nice quality product if you tend to give your cameras a bit of a hammering plus ordinary camera you can't take it out in the damp so with this you can thanks for watching bye bye